Todd Chrisley is thrilled and joyful that his family is filming a new reality television series while he is serving a 12-year sentence. The Chrisley knows best alum Todd Chrisley is apparently thrilled and happy that his mother, four of their children, and Julie Chrisley are filming a new reality TV show seven months after he and his wife Julie Chrisley entered prison. Attorney Jay Surgent stated to TMZ on Wednesday that he hopes it'll reflect the agony his family has been enduring with regard to the 54-year-old's imprisonment. Savannah, Todd's daughter, told People on Monday that she is happy to be back filming alongside her siblings Grayson, Chloe, and Chase as well as their grandma Nanny Faye because the time was right to share our story. The 26-year-old realtor said, We couldn't have found better partners in Scout Productions. Their ability to balance popular culture and empathy through authentic storytelling is unrivaled and I know they're going to find the right home for this next chapter of our lives. We're so happy to be back. Scout Productions CCO Rob Eric called the troubled family nothing short of reality royalty and said producing their return to TV is beyond thrilling. They're ready to bring their signature heart and cork back to the fans and we look forward to telling their story," Eric said in a statement. The continuation will showcase the Chrisley family being dynamically entertaining and naturally hilarious as ever, but not shying away from authentic drama and grit that makes them just as relatable as ever. The USA Network's Chrisley Knows Best, which aired for 10 seasons from 2014 to 2023, and the Peacock spin-off Growing Up Chrisley, which ran for four seasons from 2019 to 2022, introduced viewers to the wacky Georgia family. Savannah's humiliated parents, who reported to various prisons on January 18, are currently at the lowest point they have ever been as a result of the recent denial of their request for home detention. Todd was found guilty of cheating community banks out of more than $30 Emin loans and is currently serving a 12-year sentence at the federal prison camp in Pensacola, Florida for tax evasion. 50-year-old Julie is serving her seven-year sentence at the Federal Medical Center in Lexington. KY for the same charges as well as wire fraud and obstruction of justice. During the three-week trial, it was revealed that the southern grandfather of two's alleged ex-lover and business partner Mark Braddock, who was granted immunity, was the one who tipped off authorities. Last week, a family insider told DailyMail.com that the married couple of 27 years are feeling completely hopeless about their situation and are terrified at the idea of losing their appeal because it means at least another year, living in their hellhole jails. The attorney maintains that the Chrisley's request for home confinement wasn't even processed and that their unfavorable prison conditions, which they claim include a lack of air conditioning, mold, and plumbing problems, constitute cruel and unusual punishment. He also maintains that his client's Eighth Amendment rights were clearly violated during the appeals process. Des Bryant, Tyler Cameron, Black China, Brian Austin Green, Robert Horry, Aaron Jackson, Bode Miller, Jack Osborne, Tara Reed, Kelly Rizzo, Tom Sandoval, J.O.J. Osiwa, and Nick Vile will also appear in the Quasi-Military Training Series.